Welcome to the Daily Stock Report, brought to you by Quality Stocks, where performance is tracked daily. I'm Bonnie Chase, and for Monday, July 28th, we're bringing you the latest news from around the markets. Today's headline news is brought to you by MyEcheck. MyEcheck offers online merchants, call centers, billers, retail POS, and RDC back office applications, an array of comprehensive Check21 imaging, processing, and related solutions. The company was created to meet the demand for an alternative payment solution to credit cards when buying products and services online. Let's get into the headline news. Banks stepped up their borrowing over the past week from the Federal Reserve's emergency lending program, while Wall Street firms didn't draw such loans. A Fed report said commercial banks averaged $16.4 billion in daily borrowing over the past week. That was up from the $13.9 billion in the previous week. And now for a look at the market news Quality Stocks is tracking. Market headlines are brought to you by Medifile International Inc. Medifile International is focused on developing technologies and services that assist clients with the collection, management, and distribution of key health data, including medical records and images. The Quality Stocks Daily Newsletter would like to recap a few of our big timers for the week. Uranium Hunter Corporation. With headquarters in Toronto, Ontario, Uranium Hunter Corporation is a natural resource corporation focused on the exploration and development of deposits of uranium and gold in East Africa. The company trades on the OTCBB and has a wholly owned subsidiary, Gambaro Resources. Patient Access Solutions, Inc. Patient Access Solutions, Inc. is a healthcare solutions company. They're a leading provider of healthcare and financial processing solutions for the healthcare, home care, and dental industries. The company's Pass Health web portal system and terminal-based solutions offer electronic medical eligibility, electronic referrals, and service authorizations. Strongbow Resources, Inc. The company's goal is to seek additional mineral properties in Australia. They plan to identify, negotiate, and rely upon third-party farm ins and other joint venture partners to assist in the exploration and development of current and future properties. And that's it for our newsmakers. Stay tuned right here to Quality Stocks Daily Newsletter for the latest news from small cap to large cap and everything in between by Quality Stocks, where performance is tracked daily. Please be sure to see our disclaimer on the Quality Stocks website. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Bonnie Chase. Have a great day, and we'll see you tomorrow right here on the Quality Stocks Daily Report. Hi, I'm Bonnie Chase. I'm originally from Southern California. That's where I grew up, that's where I went to school at Advanced Marketing and UC Davis, and that's where I had my first taste of my love for marketing when I started working for a company called Oxford Equity. It's an international marketing company that gave me the opportunity to learn a ton about marketing, advertising, and PR. Two years ago, I moved here to Phoenix, and I co-founded The Mark Consulting, which has been an awesome experience. Working with Quality Stocks has been a really great experience for me because I get to combine my love and knowledge for marketing with the opportunity to work in a new media and help distribute information out to people that are looking for it. My name is Bonnie Chase and you can look for me at qualitystocks.net.